Hi there, I uh, would like to show you a nice motor home we have. It's a Swift Suntour. It's a 630G. It's a 2003 model with the 2.8 turbo diesel engine. It runs very nicely. It's only done 31,375 miles at this time. Body works in very good condition. The side entry door on the proper side with the electric step there, twin electric step, good tyres, etc. Nice big van, it has the side awning as well. There. And there's also sides for the side awning, I believe, here as well. A lot of bits and pieces with the van, top aerial, top roof rack, large garage door here. Large goes right across the back end of the van. Plug in for electrics, vents. As you can see, the tyres are all good, new, nice covers. Then round the back of the van, the Suntour model, the Swift. There's a rack on the roof, and there's also a ladder to access the rack on the roof. Condition. Round the other side. The other side. This side we have the access locker for the gas bottles, the twin gas bottles, the emptying out point for the toilet, window, there's a large bed above the, the garage in the back, that's the window, there's a large bed, the toilet, step back a bit and give you a view of the side, well good size van, large van, easy to drive, power steering, Drives really nicely. Left the door open here. Just to let you see inside the, the cabin. It's got the large bed again, it's got six berth. Six berth, double at the front at the top, double in the middle, and double at the rear end. Good size beds, both all good size beds. Down to the cabin here. Nice condition. There's covers on the seats. There's swivel seats also, and one has the Lumbar support pressure system, the passenger side. It's nice too, everything's nice and clean. All the doors are all good and clean. The latches, again, good tyres as you can see. And I don't know if I'll show you the mileage, but it's only done 31,000. There's the radio, CD, etc, etc. Very nice one. Moving around to the front now. <coughs> Shut the door over. You have a quick look inside the engine compartment. Another catch. It is. Nice clean engine compartment. 2.8 turbo diesel. Drives really well. Very powerful. Nice, tidy, clean. Drop that down. Let's have a look inside now. There's a handle on the door here that lets you to give you a bit of a grip when you're going in and out. Maybe step up, but not bad. Into the van now, straight ahead of us we have a seating area. There is a table there for it as well. The seating area makes it into a double, a double bed. Good, cools out. Cushions there, headrests, etc. Up above it, plenty of storage. Loads of storage up here. Empty storage, all nice, clean, tidy. Nice, clean, tidy. There's some spare curtains there. Got these spotlights. Very nice. Good high van. Good, good size van. Nice, not so good, spacious. The fronts, very spacious. Fronts, very spacious. Very clean. Very clean indeed. Empty lights. This part folds down, obviously to make your large double bed and there is a, a ladder there I believe yeah there's a ladder there too for accessing that curtains there too across the back of the van front of the van right to the opposite side of the van as you come in the door there's a, a unit here you set your telly on if you wanted up above it there's a cocktail cabinet it's a cocktail cabinet put some pieces in it Storage and all your controls for your battery, etc. Your battery control unit up here. 
It gives you lights and your internal pump. Lights there. All the roof lights are operated by that. Going backwards. We have a nice stainless steel sink. We've drained all the water off it for the winter with the glass top. Down below, you have a large fridge. Again, good condition. We now need clean at the bottom. I think the, just a wee bit need a wipe. Uh, the sink's really nice, tidy too. Good cooker. And grill and oven below that there. Some side drawers. I believe there's cutlery, etc, etc. And the side drawers up the top with more storage. Again, plates and dishes, cups, etc. Bits and pieces, etc. And this one as well it has the adjustable TV aerial. Big hecky skylight. Gives you plenty of light in the van. Opposite that, there's the, the tables in here. Tables in the cupboard here, and then you have the good sized toilet. Good sized toilet with the swivel loo, and good big wash hand basin with mirror. Again, all clean, tidy, nice condition. Practically opposite that, we have a, a wardrobe, big double wardrobe. Good control units in it on the walls here. I think I need plenty of space. Oh, bits and pieces. Behind that again we have a two step two step up to above the the garage which is a big double a large double windows at both sides there's some spare mattressing there and some spare cushions and to make up the beds Lights above it, all clean, tidy as well. Loads of space, that massive big bed. A small skylight above it, and a, a curtain here to divide it off. Then below the wardrobe, there is a gas electric heater for heating in the van. And as I say, there's plenty of cupboards and drawers underneath the, the laptops here. A really, really nice van. Uh, if you're interested in the van, it's a 2013, as I say, uh, 2003, sorry, uh, is MOT'd to well on next year, November next year. Mechanically, it's good. Um, we recommend coming to Hart to view it. You'll get it on our website or on the Auto Trader site. But uh, be happy to see anybody that wants to a trial in it. We'll be able to give them a trial in it. Thanks for viewing the van. Bye now.